Hey everyone, fast beginning because we are slow. What's going on, everybody? We're super duper slow. It's on you, on me. It's on me. All right. Well, here's the deal, folks. This has been sitting here for a few days. It's my bad. I didn't get to it. Vet started getting requests for it, and I said, "Yeah, I know, dude. I'm lagging." But we ain't got nothing better to do but react. So we're going to react to this right now. So everybody on Vet Reacts, you get to see Savannah Dexter remember everything. For those of you who asked me to do it, you get to see it here. So uh, hope you all like it. Um, everything we've done so far from Savannah Dexter has been really good. I, I've liked it. Um, she shocked all of us, I think. You know, I, and I'll, I'll tell a funny story yesterday. For those of you who missed my live where I bitched about my fucking unexpected brokenness in a part in my Forerunner, uh, the mechanic came out and his wife came out and they were talking to me and it turns out the mechanic's wife used to be a Katie Noel fan and likes Up Church and Moonshine Bandits and all them. And I said, oh, so you must love Savannah Dexter. She says, who's that? <laughs> so I played Ray's Health Order yesterday. After uh, the smile on her face and her writing down the name of Savannah Dexter, I think she'll be checking more of her out. So uh, that's how we contribute to get music spread. Uh, sometimes it happens naturally like that. Other times it's more forced like me driving into a gas station and blasting YZ just for fun. Um, but forward. here we go. Savannah Dexter, remember everything. Let's do it, folks. Too broke to buy the canvas to do the art on. I was in it, dropped my first single two weeks after I was evicted. But if I told you it's the brokenness that makes me so heartless, if I told you I was raped but never pressed charges, I said I hate to admit I'd give it all back just to forget. tell you that this this isn't fiction because I went through a shit, shit ton of trauma yep. and I put I went through a shit ton of trauma when I was a kid and you remember all of it even when you don't want to you can't help but remember all of it and it takes a healing process she's saying that she's even beginning to let go of it even she's gonna write this stuff down she shouldn't even to say what she shouldn't say just to help herself heal from it and that is like powerful because when you're stuck like that and you don't know how to heal it's a brutal place to be you know so let's check more of this out guys So 
many times. I don't know how many people leave. Except, Except me. Except me. Wow. Well, we're getting an inside view of what, what she's gone through, and this is going to touch a lot of people because a lot of people have experienced stuff like this, whether it's, you know, my life with experiencing my mom getting killed, my dad being a piece of shit, my grandfather being an abusive alcoholic, or the other things that happened in my life, you hold on to those things and you have to find a way to heal from them, man. She's using music as this, but geez, this is, let's go. You didn't love me till I signed my deal, so stop telling me that time's gonna heal, cause I remember everything. I can't tell you that time's gonna heal, but I can tell you that I did heal. Sounds like this is part of the process. I hope it is. Because nobody needs to hold on to those bitter memories. And, with it, and, and she said something in there which is true, right? Like, nobody who's going through this shit wants to hear when you say time will heal it. Because it's not true. Because it's it, not true. You're trying everything work. and it ain't working. It takes work. I mean, for me, I. I can't even tell you how long I suffered through misery before it got better, but I will tell you this, it got better. Um, it's savage. Absolutely savage. Yo, bro, how did... I ain't heard that voice in my head forever, bro. Um, Dude, are you okay? Did you take your pill? I didn't hear it. Oh, you That's... definitely did. What are you looking at, bro? Are you hearing things again? Where is my voice? My voice needs to tell your voice to be quiet. My voice is on vacation. You shut your mouth when you're talking to me. I heard it that time. We're all fucked. I, I mean, honestly, she shouldn't have to wait. No, carry that did, on this, this, this song is a process i think it's the beginning of a pro well not just the beginning it sounds like she's been going through it man we'll pray for your your, your healing in that because it is not a fun place when you're still deal dealing with all those horrible memories uh savannah dexter i appreciate this song i appreciate all your music uh you're you're new uh, to me um i i haven't I, I have to say man the first song i heard was the raise hell and now I've heard a lot of other stuff from her. And, man, she goes way deeper than just raise hell. So, uh, you know, thank you, Savannah, for putting this out there. It is going to help people. I hope it helped you, too. Uh, we love your music. You guys, we love you being here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, uh, we will see you guys soon. I got another one coming up. Uh, and uh, so keep an eye out for that. But, uh, Vet, the voice in our head, and everybody, thank you for being here. Uh, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell notification button. Select all. Don't forget to drop more uh, suggestions in the comment section down below. Let us know how we're doing. If you got uh, suggestions for uh, Vet or for Wick Street, you can put them in the comments. Uh, just like you can put comments for me in theirs because we're always together, guys. That's how we found out about this. He said he had a recommendation for it. I said, I know it's sitting in my watch later. Let's do it. So, uh... We're glad we got to it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. We'll see you real soon. As always, be healthy, be happy, be good to each other. Stay blessed. God bless y'all. God bless y'all. Peace.